have been enjoying this little boat. I feel like I can take it out in the bay in uh, some pretty big waves. When I want a, a chill day, I can take it back into Clear Lake in some shallow areas. I kind of run in between Redfish Island and the Party Cove at the back of Clear Lake and it's just been a blast. Just a, a tough little boat that I feel like can do anything. I really like it. As we float on a breeze, effortless with ease, will you dance along with me? We've discovered this new life. Watch our fantasies ignite as the sky opens wide. My time will come for breaking free, and all I know is I'll be ready. I didn't only buy this boat because I like the way it looked, I like the numbers. At only 23 foot long, it's a length that I'm comfortable handling around the dock. It only draws two and a quarter foot, so I won't run aground. With a displacement ratio of a 46% of the total weight being ballast, I know it's going to stand up, and it has a nearly eight foot beam, so there's enough room inside. Well, I haven't made a video for a while because uh, I've just been sailing this boat. I haven't been working on it. I wanted to find out what I liked about it and what I didn't like. The first thing that I'm unhappy about is that I had the mast rewired and they didn't do the old wire tie trick or anything and the wires are slapping around inside the mast. It's very annoying. If anybody knows a fix for this problem while keeping the mast up and without having to take it down, that would be a great help if you leave a message in the comments. Thank you. Yeah, this boat really needs a uh, new foil rudder. Some running rigging, halyards ran aft, connect the nav lights, the tiller pilot would be awesome. New cabin cushion would be nice, run that anchor road through, paint and seal the deck, about four grand. I've been working on setting up this boat for single handing. I've got my bungee cord steering system and I've got my jib downhaul. Free. All I know is I'll be 